Julius Henry Taylor, black physicist. The physicist Julius H. Taylor has taught and done research at a number of institutions, including the University of Pennsylvania and Morgan State College, later University, in Baltimore, Maryland. In addition to his work as an educator, he is known for his research in solid-state physics, his efforts in spaceflight development for NASA, and for the 1955 book, The Negro and Science, which he edited. Julius Henry Taylor was born on February 15, 1914 in Cape May, New Jersey. He earned his B.A. degree at Lincoln University in Pennsylvania in 1939, when he was 25 years old. Two years later, in 1941, he received his Master's of Science from the University of Pennsylvania in Philadelphia. During World War II, Taylor worked as a research assistant at the University of Pennsylvania, a position he held until 1945. The term for Taylor's area of specialty, solid-state physics, would not even be coined until 1951. As for the name itself, it describes a branch of, sci a branch of science dealing with the properties of solid metals with regard to conducting electricity. St solid-state physicists study the structure and reactivity of a solid material, especially the behavior of ions molecules, nucleons, and electrons within it. They work with crystals and explore the effects of imperfections on solid substances. While he was at the University of Pennsylvania during the year from 1943 to 1944, Taylor held a Rosenwald Fellowship. In 1945, he became a physics professor at West Virginia State College in Institute West Virginia. From 1947 to 1949, he returned to the University of Pennsylvania as a research physicist. Meanwhile, meanwhile, he conducted he continued to work on his PhD PhD degree, which he would earn from Pennsylvania in 1950. Taylor's dissertation concerned the properties of germanium, germanium, a semi-metallic element with qualities similar to those of silicon. First isolated in 1886, germanium would later be used for optical instruments and as a semiconductor in transistors. In 1949, Taylor became a professor of physics at Morgan State College, later renamed Morgan State University, in Baltimore, Maryland. The following year, he was named chairman of the department, a position he would hold for the next quarter century. In 1953, he received a research award from the Army's Office of Ordnance Research, which explored developments in explosives. Taylor continued to receive the research award for each year through 1957. In 1955, Taylor served as editor for a notable historical work on African-American contributions to scientific knowledge, the Negro in Science. 24 years after his graduation from college, in 1963, Lincoln University made him its alumnus of the year. Taylor left Morgan University in 1978 when NASA, the National Aeronautics and Space Administration, awarded him, awarded him a contract at their Goddard, Goddard Space Flight Center. Taylor is married to Patricia Spaulding and they have two children, Dwight and Trina. The Taylors live in Baltimore. He is or has been a member of the American Physical Society, the American Institute of Physics, Beta Kappa Chi, the Chesapeake American Association of Physics Teachers, President from 1962 to 1963, the Governor Science Advisory Council, the National Committee of Physics in Secondary Education, of the American Association of Physics Teachers, the National Institute of Science, the National Science Foundation, Sigma Chi, the Society of Physics Students, Zone Counselor, and the Travelers Aid Society. Citations are in the description.